have to track her offensively as well. She's had some breakout games, and that's a wonderful sequence. What's more, fed by Ledger. Walker Bella knew what to do with it. And she's so reliable as well. That's a wide open three, and it's buried. We talked about what Wallach did against Arizona State on Friday. Martinez unable to spin it in. Love the take, though. Aggressive take. They need to keep trying to jam it down their throats. Did you mention oh three point gosh. shots? <laughs> Timeout, Adia Barnes. Mentioned that Fields really focuses on the other aspects of her game. And when you have everybody else averaging better than 11 points, you're going to be unselfish. Pueo off the bench, filling in for Ledger Walker. She was not at all slowed down by the magnitude of the moment. Speaking of the freshman, Najee feeding Martinez for her first bucket. As Mary Martinez always battling for those weak side boards. Look at the muscle up here. She remains red hot. 11 points for as Mary. Another low scoring game. Shades of what we saw on Friday night. Well, Motuga stayed with it. Looked like the ball was just going to trickle <laughs> off her fingertip. 1.45 to go. Do it wide open, and she buries it. Marquette and Connor trying to come up with the swipe. Bella to the bucket, and the whistle comes. Indeed, that is confirmation. Open look. Tedar, she rails it for her first hoop of the game. Sophomore season, I guess we'd call it, junior season, and, and has a, had a slow start this year, so. Great. Loose ball and the opportunity for Ledger Walker, another chance for Washington State to tack on two more. All of eight floor, but the Cougs still have an opportunity to build on their lead with the shot clock at two into American Tech Day beats the clock. That is highly effective, 11 points for Bella. It was a Pac-12 freshman of the week early in November. Shining at non-conference play. Motuga, three. Knocks it down. Clark tried the overplay. Martinez looks to make her pay. Ball movement's going to find Gilbert for three. She is a supremely confident freshman. That's why. Not the most astute shot there. Maybe got a little bit too jacked up. I haven't seen too many bad shots like that from Washington State here today. Potter back-to-back threes! Wallach, played by Connor. Excellent sequence as Mercadette fell. Wallach, she's got nine. On Friday, Washington had the lead going to the fourth. Lavelle! <laughs> I don't know if that's exactly what she had in mind. Washington State with a four-point lead. Eight minutes to go. Duhena, open for three. She stripes it. Eight, he's got ten. On Friday, when they rallied to beat Washington, down eight with 5.30 to go. Connor for three. <laughs> she just needs so little space and time. Kind of surprised that Washington State left her single coverage. Great finish. Long layup by Reese. Motuga! So, a variety of implications in the 70 to 59 victory for washington state they make some program history coming up with their first road sweep in arizona since 2013